All right, this afternoon we're going to learn how to measure washers and nuts. You're going to need possibly your necklace, uh, bolt gauge, and nut gauge. I like the little red nut and bolt gauge, and it'll help to have your fastener numbering guide. A couple of things you're going to want to know is there is a grade 5 nut. It may have three marks or it may be plain. Your grade 8 nut will have your six marks on it. There is a USS washer that fits tight around the bolt but is much bigger and there is an SAE washer that uh, is a little loose around the bolt but it's also narrower. The easy way to measure these is using this bolt gauge. Now this bolt gauge has studs on both ends of it and there's a shoulder on the stud. Coarse nuts will fit to that shoulder and stop like this. Fine thread nuts will slide all the way to the base. The way you determine what your nut is is simply find the one that it slides on tightly like this and you know this one's a 3 8 so You also know that this is a grade 8 nut, and we now know it's grade 8 and a 3 8 Go into our fastener numbering guide, a grade 8 coarse thread nut is a prefix number 22. 3 8 is a letter I. You'll know the part number to this nut because it's a grade 8 coarse nut is 22I. Now to measure washers, basically you do the same thing for your flat washers and your lock washers. You know which bolt they go over and you go to your washer gauge. We're using grade 8 at this point in time and we're using a coarse thread. So your grade eight coarse thread is going to be a 23 prefix. It's still a 3 eighths, so it's an I. So its part number is a 23 I. This is a, a simple measuring device. You can also use the necklace and just slide these over whichever stud they go on and know which size they are. And uh, this is definitely a use it or lose it. The more you practice measuring nuts and washers and bolts, the easier it is to retain. Good luck.